This story will cover from then to now and next, all about change, how to turn losers into winners. A very beautiful place changed by people. And that still goes on, for good or for bad, in the lovely Mediterranean Sea. This is a story as old as time, indeed since life on Earth first appeared. How we live today is a mere blink of the eye. As a result of evolution, we inherit today a fantastic natural world, so diverse, so surprising, but so vulnerable. And, as it turns out, in one tiny part of the Mediterranean, the link between plants and insects became so crucial. From invertebrates came the backboned animals, fish, amphibians like frogs, reptiles like snakes, and turtles, living dinosaurs of today. Then came the birds, flippers to feathers and flight, enabling an osprey, an astonishing view of what was once an empty shoreline, such as this turtle nesting beach in Turkey. Plus sunbeds now. And then in the story of life on Earth and the living planet came the biggest change of all, the mammals. And we are mammals. And since we've arrived, we've changed the face of our only home, the Earth. In the Mediterranean, some say shipwrecked beach. In Zante in Greece, symbolizes the way things are going. Well, we'll see. And what we'll see is a protest between David and Goliath, the locals of Corfu Island and the Greek government, NCH Capital, a powerful American property company based in New York. It's all about a beautiful part of Corfu, threatened by development. That's a familiar scenario, yes, but in this case a classic in the light of the pandemic and tourism into the future. Yes, they do love Eremitis. Well, who wouldn't for its natural beauty, empty beaches, lakes and wildlife. Yes, we will see what happens. <laughs> 